I know what you're thinking. Sure, climate change is a global problem, but how will it really affect me? My air conditioning bill will get more expensive, but on the plus side, I can enjoy longer summers. Hopefully I'll get some more days off from work with more typhoons and rainstorms. Maybe I'll enjoy less exotic fruits and vegetables, but I'll live. But they say, if the temperature rises two degrees above pre-industrial levels, we'll face a major decrease in crop yields from developing countries. In some parts of Asia, the rising climate is causing drought and water shortage, while in others, the heavy rains are causing floods and mudslides. So there will be a shortage in the foods we're used to, but those farmers who cultivate these products will lose their livelihoods. Families will be plunged into abject poverty with their basic rights to health and education denied. Climate change will largely impact those with the least options, the poor. In search of the basic securities and freedoms that we enjoy, people will be on the move. An environmental refugee crisis is inevitable. Unseen, uncounted, and unrecognized, millions all over the world are already in search of greater resource security, with the floods in Pakistan adding 20 million to the ranks. It may seem like your life in Hong Kong won't be affected by these unfortunate truths, but the impacts of climate change are already transcending geopolitical boundaries. Climate change will not recognize culture, religion, ethnicity, or profession. In Hong Kong, we must look past these labels and respond collectively as a leader in the region. Because who knows, one day, we could all be climate refugees.